Welcome to Timber Masters. This video is a guide for box beam installation. Tools needed for installation. You will need a framing square, power or handsaw, tape measure, marker, knife, drill with three inch screws and a stud finder. You could also use an 18 gauge brad nailer or a hammer with small finishing nails. When you receive your package, ensure to check over your order for any shipping damage and advise Timber Masters immediately. Our premium box beams have a lock miter corner with baffle construction ensuring strength and stability. Step 1. Mark the location of your box beams to be installed. For more convenience, a chalk line can also be used. The installation cleat, which is normally trimmed dimensional lumber, should be marked for installation into solid framing. Pre-install 3-inch deck screws. Ensure your installation cleat is cut to correct length and either has a slight taper or a 1 8 inch spacing for ease of the box beam install. Securely fasten into framing or backing material that is behind the drywall. Step 2. Start at one end of the beam. Use a framing square and check the squareness of the wall to see it. Measure and confirm the total length required prior to cutting. Your box beams come with extra length, unless specified for site-specific install requirements. Recut the end of the beam if necessary for the correct angle, ensuring to cut off the minimum required. Note. Pre-score the wood with a sharp knife prior to cutting. Step three, repeat step two for the other end of the beam. For precise installation, remove the drywall on one end. Take a cut off from the end of the beam you have cut. Place against the wall, ensuring it slides easily over the installed cleat and mark precisely where the drywall is to be removed. Then using a sharp knife or a multi-tool, cut the drywall and remove as required. Note, box beams can be installed precisely against the wall with this method or can be ordered with a small trim to ensure a precise finish. Step four, lift the box beam. Insert one end into the removed drywall first. Then pull the box beam tight against the opposite wall, all while lifting the beam tight against the ceiling. Once the beam is placed in the desired location, nail through the side of the box beam into the pre-installed cleat. You are now finished. Touch up drywall or paint as required. Thank you for watching. For any additional information or questions, please contact us at Timbermasters.